Mama, God go help us, we know if you shout the word for our babies. So. This video is so cute. This is mm -hmm. like the dance video, the dance rehearsal video. Mm -hmm. they, were, they, they, were in, they were in the dance studio, they were dancing. Yeah, they, yeah, they yeah, but you know Banky is a dancer though. Yes. And you know he shoots his videos himself though. Mm, yes, I know. And it's you know that he's also, he also sings the song. <laughs> so, of course, when you have all of that, yeah. You know that he's a perfectionist. Yeah, 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 he is actually. And I was I was just talking to my friend about him yesterday, about Banky Dobby yesterday. This guy brought whiskey though. Like let's let's not let's remember. Mm. In case we are forgotten. This guy actually brought whiskey. Mm. So Banky W is big ups to you. Big ups to amazing. big ups to Banky, definitely. Boss. And yeah. Mm. So Anyway, that's an amazing song. Mm -hmm. Let's move on to the next story and welcome back to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. So popular love doctor Juru Lumofi <laughs> has once <laughs> again taken to social media to give his fellow men a guide on how to know if a woman is a wife material. According to him, if you want to be sure about the lady you are dating, just give her on Drake key. That's two hundred and fifty dollars too old for you this December. Then ask for it the first week in February, and if she's able to give you the money back in full, she's a wife material. Joro then advised men to immediately marry such a woman if she returns all the money, but if she removes ten naira from it, run for your life because she's not good wife material and probably can't keep money for dry season. Where is this guy saying? Well, that one deal, that one really day, my guy. Yeah, it, it actually day, but. Because actually, they because of because, because of the case of Gucci Mane and his wife Kisha Kaur, I mean, Kisha Kaur, he before he went to jail, like I think he gave her like three million dollars or something. And, and she made it ten million dollars so by the time he came out. I mean, that that is a good anal analogy. But saying you are giving your girl hundred k in December and asking for it back in January, what if the girl already has like, one million and she can give you at any time, but she still has a, a terrible attitude? That one day. Mm -hmm. that what one if she has day. enough money? So hundred k when they use judge. See, if you haven't been there, mm. you probably wouldn't even know. Mm. I've been there. Mm. So I, I know what, exactly what he's talking about, right? Where... Okay, I have to be very careful with my choice of words in this particular one. Mm -hmm. Where you just know that sometimes, regardless of the amount of money given to somebody, mm -hmm. what you're trying to see is what is going to be the outcome. Especially when you know that they don't have a means to make such an amount. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? That makes sense. Mm? That makes sense. You know they don't have the means to make such an amount, mm -hmm. and then you now give it to them, and then it don't be short. Okay. Then you go the one that say, I gave it to you based on trust. Why is they loss? You see, girl power, girl power. You don't want broke girls again. All girls should get money. All girls are already getting money. All girls should so hustle. They're already getting money. So I don't think 100K is, any, is a problem for any girl right now. Most girls. Ha! Big girls. Ha! <laughs> 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 yeah, I just cracked the joke. Are you basket mount? 100k is not a problem for most girls. No, no, I should hype them now. But most girls. Is this guy in basket. Girls on the island are doing well, though. Mm? Girls, girls have money, bro. Girls have money. Yeah, but all girls have money. Say that in the package, no means they don't get money. Say that Say that in the package, no means they don't get money. The fact that I'm using an iPhone 13, I'm wearing the flat, uh, fly, flyest outfit, I pull up to your events in a car that's probably be, that probably belongs to somebody else and all of that doesn't mean that I'm doing well. But but really, I, I'm, I'm, I'm more proud of our females now because most girls that I know are doing well on their own. Yes, to be course. honest, most girls naturally, yes, they're doing naturally great. should be doing well, especially because we know that it is not a man's world, it's a woman's world. Mm -hmm. Let's be real with it. Mm -hmm. If we really want to be real, it's a woman's world. Every woman has 10% chance of being doing better than you out of 100. Yeah. So if we're talking about 100%, yeah, they have a 110% chance to be better than you. Sure. Do you understand? Based on the fact that they can actually lay their hands on anything, and still be able to market and still get returns from what they're doing based on the fact of their gender. Mm -hmm. Are you getting me? Mm -hmm. But not a lot of people see it like that. Do you mm -hmm. get where I'm coming from? Uh, no, I, 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 I feel like, and I'm being honest, the most dangerous person is a woman who knows who, knows who she is and understands, understands yeah, yeah, yeah. who she is. Mm -hmm. I, and I said that because, I think yesterday too, my friend was checking the richest women on earth. I think Lillian Bretton caught his first, Alice Walton his second, Mackenzie Dern 
is third. Mm. They better cause from I, I can't remember Alice Watts in Walmart. Then mm. Mackenzie Dern was divorced. Jeff Bezos. Mm. She didn't have anything before. The richest actor. Remember on this show when I was talking about why would an actor mm. want to act? We now went to check. I, my friend checked. What do you mean? Why would an actor want to it, act? It, it, no, it, why would a billionaire want, want to act? To act yeah. There are no billionaire actors. So I checked it and I talked to richest actors and number one is one one girl that I've never heard of in my life. And she has 2.2 billion or 3.2 billion source of wealth, divorce. Second person is was Tom Cruise with 650 million. Divorce. No, richest <laughs> people, Tom I'm Cruise just from playing, acting. I'm just playing. So women, women that know their worth. A woman can act and pretend and play you just to get what she wants to get in the future. So it's it's I mean, it's painful and it's complicated, to be honest, but Alrighty. that's life. Alrighty, man, let's move on to the next story, which one is on Bibi Niger, one of my favorite people in the world. Bibi Niger's Watoni, who claimed the company recently withdrew their endorsement deal with her because she is controversial. The mom of one stated that they stated this on Twitter, on her Twitter handle, where she wrote, was going to sign another endorsement before the, the year ends, but they withdrew because I am not controversial. One of my colleagues, do you all do you all the way if it brings food on the table? What do you think? Who is this? Who is talk to this to talk. So she's saying that, man, everybody should get controversial. But you see, eh, the thing about brands is that mm -hmm. they actually want to see your engagement level. Now, um, a lot of people thought it was over for Tiwa Savage mm -hmm. after that, you know, saga. Told you guys. But mm -hmm. Suddenly, Tiwa Savage is even doing better. Yes. There are like three concerts in for Tiwa she Savage singing. in December. Do you understand? Live in Abuja, live in Oweri, live in Lagos. Do you so you're wondering, like, why are people still going out to see Tiwa? Mm -hmm. Do you get what I mean? So that's the thing about showbiz. There's no such thing as bad publicity. I, I, I was going to say that. It's called showbiz for a reason. Don't forget mm -hmm. the show part. Mm -hmm. It's show. Let mm. them see you. You, you, are, you. you are literally famous for being on a TV show for 90 days, fighting for 100k, 100k dollars. So mm -hmm. this is what we know you for. We know you for seeing you on TV. So what are you doing? That you're, that so you're, now you don't want to be my brand ambassador and you're not even you're not boring. You're not doing anything. anything. No, please don't you're complain. Just you're just saying I'm Watoni, I'm Watoni, I'm Watoni, Dubai. Dubai, Watoni. Please, nobody Dubai. cares. Mm? And, you think, and, th and you think that's what the people give are going us, to buy Give us into. content, give us things to see. Of course, we know. need to see things. Yeah. So, um, in as much as um, we would like to agree with her, we can't because at the end of the day, being a brand influencer or a brand ambassador is what you are bringing to the table. It's not just your personality because if it was just your personality, then you should be a musician. But you can't be a reality TV star and you want to be a brand ambassador and you are boring. Don't you understand? They don't even hear anything from you. It's not like today you are talking about your child. It's not like today you are tweeting something you controversial. Don't you don't have like you have what a show. You, what you do? don't have anything. So, well, Tony, I think it's you that needs to up your yes. game. Yes, up your game. Up your totally your hustle. Understand what it means to be a brand ambassador. Yes, Do you get what I mean? Mm -hmm. All right, so next story multi award winning movie director and producer Imo Imore has dropped a piece of advice to those who derive pleasure from cheating on their partners. According to Imore, such people should be should use protection as it is unfair to break someone's heart and also give them an infection gotten from the person he or she cheated with. And yes, I've always said this, I've always said this, I've never held back on it. I have protection at home. I have a steady relationship. Mm -hmm. I have protection at home. I have protection in my car. And sometimes, if possible, sometimes I have it in my pockets, depending on where I'm going to. But you have, you have a steady relationship. Why do you need protection everywhere you go? I'm just saying because you know this, you know this life, you know this lifestyle, my, you know, know this know. job, Please. you know how these women get. Sometimes things just happen unexpectedly mm. that you are not even planning it. Wow. You didn't plan it. You didn't even think of it. Mm. But you see these ladies, right? They have their ways all the time. And then when it happens, now, now, <laughs> listen, right? I have a very strong self-control. I've never cheated on my girlfriend, right? Okay. But I have a very solid self-control. But one thing is that I always stay protected. Regardless, I just always have it. Hmm. Do you understand? Hmm. I'm sure if you check the one in my car, it's been there for about three years now. It's very dusty, I bet. Hmm. Do you get what I mean? But it doesn't mean it's not there. Just in case I just get caught up sure. in the car one day. It's just somewhere I can just... 
Eh? Oh, with someone. It could be anybody. Could be I'm me. human, bro. Mm. Why are you gonna? What, are you trying to? Do you see me like the type of guy that's gonna lie? That look. If I see another fly girl tomorrow, I probably wouldn't smash. I probably would. I, 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 are you? Are you? Are you promoting unfaithfulness? I'm not promoting unfaithfulness. I'm just saying that stay protected. That, that's what this story is about. <laughs> Nobody's promoting unfaithfulness. True, true, this guy's just true, saying that true, it is true. unfair true. for you to give her a break true. and still give, give infection. Yes, Do you understand? Like, why would I want to put you in that position? I don't even know who I'm, 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 I'm having the... It, it could be on the influence of alcohol. It could be the influence on, on anything. Do you get what I mean? Now, if I make a mistake, does that mean my mistake should affect you? Hmm. It shouldn't. Mm. It's just commonsensical, which is why I always tell guys: as long as you are a man, always have protection. It makes sense. What's saying makes sense actually. Always it have it. Just always have it. Mm -hmm. I've seen married men that always have protection. Mm -hmm. They're married. Mm -hmm. It doesn't mean they are going to do it. it. Doesn't mean they plan to do it. But just in case, just in case. Mm -hmm. It happens, True. right? Mm -hmm. Am I going to be protected? Am I going to be protecting my partner? I think it is still a sign of love. You are putting your partner first before your sexual urges. Mm. Simple as ABC. True. True. Uh, but, but I really think for if I'm in relationship in relationships, I think if you really love your partner, would you even have would that even be an option? Like, <laughs> like I, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not the holiest person. I mean, I've messed up in my relationships, but I mean, if there is really love. You shouldn't be cheating. But if you are cheating, like he said, and like you said, always carry protection. Always I'm not saying protection. cheating. You're not even getting the point. I'm not saying this time. Cheating is not the aim. Cheating is not the agen agenda. Stay cheating protected. Is not what, just have your protection because you are a man. And a lot of men actually think with their penis than they think with their brain. Mm -hmm. Are you getting so, me? Because we are men, we should cheat. I feel like if I need to you're you're being very difficult because I know you actually do <laughs> understand what I am talking about. I don't now, what I am talking about is that as a man, <laughs> you know that a lot of men do not actually think with true, their true, brains true, when true, it comes true. to the other. It just happens. Sex. It just happens. Yeah, true. When it comes to the other sex, especially look, look. I don't look, forgive my I gender if you've been hurt before. Forgive my gender. It's not just about your gender. It's not just, it's, it happens to everybody. It happens. But because women cannot, you cannot advise women to carry protection, protection because sense, yes. how do, a lot of them don't even know how to use their own protection. Carry for whoever you want to cheat with, women. They are not planning. Oh. You see, the difference is that you are thinking of people that are planning to cheat, that go out there to actually cheat. Have you ever been in a situation where you're probably sad or mad at your partner and you're gisting with the next girl and the fact that you're cheat I'm gisting with the next girl and you people are talking over a bottle or something, mm -hmm. she's beginning to lean on your shoulder, she's already talking about being tipsy, you guys are laughing a lot, you guys are hugging each other and all of that. And anything could happen in that moment. Mm -hmm. In that moment, would I be protected? Mm -hmm. That's my question to you. Always in that moment where my guards are down, would I be protected? Mm, makes sense. That's a question. Mm -hmm. It's not that I, I went, I just went out to have a drink with a friend and talk about my emotional trauma. Mm -hmm. And it led to something else. Have you not seen girls that they say they're attracted to men that are heartbroken? Have you, nev have yes, you never seen normal. that before? Mm, there are girls that they just want to be there for you when you're heartbroken. Mm -hmm. That is when they really want to be there. Mm -hmm. But you see, when you're your girl, you're Gucci, they don't even want to see you. Mm -hmm. But the moment you just tell them that, man, I, I just want to leave the house, man, I'm heartbroken right now. They are there for you. They'll be like, okay, yes, I'm at home now, come through. Mm. Do you get what I mean? Mm. Yeah, so it happens. And I'm not trying to make excuses for men that cheat. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying that, men, at the end of the day, just stay protected. Stay protected. Stay, stay, stay woke. Protected. Stay woke. Yes, yeah, stay mm -hmm. protected. And don't go and give another person's daughter, mm -hmm. you know, a sexually transmitted disease from somebody Else. that you don't even trust, that you didn't even plan somebody to Somebody's like, you don't enjoy with. it. If you, only you enjoy it, then you give her something else. That's mm -hmm. unfair. That's, she yes, exactly. That. So you are no longer being difficult. Now I'm you get my point. I agree. Thank you.